He threw his change up more than 35% of the time against Cincinnati. Here's the 0-2, and this ball is in the air. Right center field, pretty well hit. And it is off the very top of the wall. This could, this could be inside the park territory. They're going to send it, and the throw to the plate's not going to get there. And inside the park home run for Nimmo. What a follow-up to what he did in the ninth inning. And in front of a lot of friends and family. Subaru Supermo, a little slider, but he clips it on the sweet spot of the bat. You know, both Charlie and Carlos are over there. They're ready for it to come off the wall, but look how far it careens away, and Nimmo never stops running. His 11th home run this year. Swung on and missed, and that is... This ball's in the air to pretty deep right field. Cargo on the move. Can he get there? Lays out, makes the catch. Is ridiculously good. Well, first off, you see the ERA that leads all of baseball. 113 strikeouts set third, uh, 206 batting average. That's fifth. And DeGrom throws a fastball pretty much down the middle. And this is being taken by the wind, but uh, Batista will. That's a, you know, an all-star level player. This ball's well hit left center field, and it is off the middle of the wall. Conforto's gonna have a leadoff double. Conforto takes off for third, he'll steal it standing up. But he was out there for a while, and, and now you have to pull the infield in because DeGrom is in the game. Here comes Conforto, there's only one play, and that's to get Jose Batista, and a run scores, it's two to nothing. DeGrom strikes out. Put in, so he says, I'm going to be really disappointed if Trevor doesn't make it. And he said, I also already voted for Trevor, and everybody else should too. Now, a reminder you can come out to center field if you're at Coors Field. Good guys in scoring position. 2 1. This ball is wiped out toward the gap in right center. Cargo will roll home. Here goes Gerardo into second with a double. 2 to 1. Stay hot, Gerardo Park. Foul tip held. Rosario, strikeout number three. And they didn't have much competition last year. This year they've got the uh, Braves. Functionality for the players is awesome. That's awesome, too, because that's a tweener for DJ LeMayhew. And the Rockies are going to have their third double here in the early going against Jacob DeGrom. Tying run with one out at second with Charlie Blackman coming up. I think it's like $1.6 billion in the last 10 years. Uh-oh, this ball's really well hit the left center field, and Wilmer Flores has hit it out. It is 3-1 New York. That is the fourth home run for Flores. That's the tenth home run by a right-handed batter against Tyler this year. This will be a tough play for Nolan. It's really spinning, but Nolan makes it beautifully out of the zone high. This ball, oh man! Did Story elude the tag? Why is he staying out on the baseline? Right here, he dives. Goes to reach for him. You could go three feet. And this is going to be a base hit for Nimmo. And Rosario won't test Cargo's arm. And Cabrera hits it to third. There's one on the first, out at first base. But Tyler gets that ground ball, Nolan sets up, and then his pure arm strength all the way back across. Rockies trailing Jacob DeGrom 3-1, to one. and a broken bat roller short. Story goes perfectly to Ian Desmond. Last five games, he's thrown seven-plus innings. He gets a strike out there at Murphy. That guy's been doing out on the mound. He's like... Guys, I'm going to get super fancy tonight. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they don't want to get charged. This is going to be a tough chance for Nolan to just knock it down. That one had a lot of English on it. It'll be an infield hit. Three and one. Conforto bouncing off second base. And that is ball four. Now the bases are loaded. Three batters face. Gave up a couple hits. Had a leadoff walk that really hurt him. Three earned runs. And right back to the mound. Got to come home with it. 
And a good feed. And got and three pitches. And played with him and after him. That's a good play by DeGrom. He's going to take a base hit away from DJ. One out. 2-2. Two -two. That one has hit a ton to right center field. And that is a conventional home run for Nemo. What kind of tear is this kid on? And he's smiling ear to ear. He's doing it in the ballpark of the team he followed growing up. So he's basically striking out a third of the hitters he faces. It's fourth best in baseball. This is a slow roller, and it's going to work as an infield hit. And there's a base hit through the right side. Carlo go first to third here, and it's Bobbles for a moment out there. Desmond to second, and scoring is Parra. Cover it if it shows up again. Oh, straight gas. Especially to, to somebody like DeGrom, who's been doing it for a long time. This is pulled, and it's going to roll all the way to the wall. So Conforto will have a leadoff double here in the eighth inning. Jake had a rough outing down in Texas. This ball's lifted the left field to deep, and it's going to sail out of here. Devin Mazzarocco with his seventh home run, and now the Mets have opened up a four-run lead. It's six to two. The third home run tonight, but I'm not sure Mickey Calloway allows him to, to I, do it. I think he's only going eight. When they get the baseball to start the game, their mind says, I'm going to finish the game. I think DeGrom's one of those guys. He'll get two, three, and four in that Mets lineup. Cabrera. Frazier and Flores. Lively fastball, sliders. Base hit up the middle for Cabrera. The Rockies are scoring a ton of runs in June. That's a base hit. Cabrera will go first to third. That's a great deep by 3 1 ball four. And, uh, Another walk and another run comes home. Here to count the innings. They haven't scored in third inning. And this is a base hit right center field. This will get two more runs home. And it'll be another double. And then they miss up. Nimmo, ground ball up the middle, base hit. And they'll get two more home. I just don't know what to say. There's nothing really we can say. You know. He's got to weather the storm. Nine runs the last three innings for the Mets. And, and he lowered his ERA from 1.55 to 1.51. Saying you won. Two outs. This ball is well hit to left field. And it's going to die on the warning track in the glove of Nimmo, fitting that he would make the catch. 27th out. Tough night for the Rockies once again as they fall 12 to 2 to the New York Mets. And DeGrom is the winner. He's 5 and 2. Tyler Anderson takes the loss. He is 4 and 2. The Rockies have now lost eight straight games at Coors Field. That has never happened before. Their longest home losing streak ever was nine games but that was in 1993.